Keenum. But- hey, I'm Keenum, and we're going to talk about biographs in this episode. Oh, snap. Here comes the street sweeper. Beep. Okay, it looks like it crashed. Are we about ready to do some bar graphs? Let's do some bar graphs. Let's get started. Okay, a bar graph is simply one way for us to look at numbers. That's a really easy way to put it. A bar graph is an easy way to look at numbers. Let's suppose Pirate Sam has one, two blocks. And let's suppose the greater gator has one, two, three, four blocks. And oops, let's suppose I have five blocks. Pirate Sam has two. I have five. And the greater gator has four. Oh no, the greater gator, he ate our blocks. Oh, what are you doing, boys? Why are you subtracting the blocks? Pirate Sam, greater gator, come on now. We're here at the scene of what would be the bar graphs and absolute chaos has erupted as the Greater Gator and Pirate Sam just decide to destroy all the blocks and everything that we had set up. Who has the most here? It looks like the Greater Gator has one, two, three, four, five, six. It looks like I have five blocks and it looks like Pirate Sam has four blocks. The greater gator ate the greater number! So it looks like the greater gator had six blocks. Thanks, greater gator. He had six blocks. It was the bigger number. But who has the smallest number in this bar graph? It looks like Pirate Sam had the smallest number, four. Who had the red blocks? Me! I had the red blocks. I had five of them. All right, greater gator, let's put those blocks back. All right, let's change it out just a little bit. It looks like the Greater Gator still has the most. He has five blocks, and on this bar graph, it looks like Pirate Sam has four, and I have four. Four, four, Five. He always eats the bigger number, so the greater gator in this example does have the most. And it looks like me and Pirate Sam are tied. We both have four blocks. Four, four, five. Bar graphs are just a way for us to look at numbers. I'm the cube. I got six sides. I'm not a rube. The cube. How many does Pirate Sam Ham? <laughs> Pirate Sam Ham? Whoops! Pirate Sam has. Hmm. Zero blocks. Looks like I have four. And it looks like the Greater Gator this time has two. So, who has the smallest number of blocks? The Greater Gator has two. He does not have the smallest number. Pirate Sam, that's right. Pirate Sam. He has the smallest amount. He has zero or. Nothing! And I have four. I have the tallest stack. I have the most blocks out of all three of us. We're doing bar graphs. Greater Gator has the most yet again. You go, Greater Gator. Okay, looks like looks like Pirate Sam's only got two, and I have three for my friend the Greater Gator. The Greater Gator has the most at three. I have the smallest amount. I have one, and good old Pirate Sam has two. 
This is one way we can look at numbers. Okay, let's suppose that me and the greater gator both have four. And Pirate Sam, he likes to subtract. So let's say that Pirate Sam only has one this time. Who has the most amount right now? Who has the biggest stack? Mm, there's the greater gator. Oh, it looks like they're both equal. Four, four, and one. So Pirate Sam has one. I have four. And the greater gator, he has four. One, four, and four. Hmm. But if I take this away, uh oh, <laughs> that's the problem of working with magnets. If I take this away, and it's one, one, and two triangles. Oh, the greater gator, he strikes again. He's eating the two triangles. He's a hungry feller. Now the greater gator has zero. Oh, it looks like I have. What? What's going on here? Everybody's losing triangles. <laughs> Going to chart me and you with my friend Pirate Sam Who has the most shoes or top hats and kangaroos Oh, grass, they're on the loose Oh, grass, they're on the loose Put it up Who's first and last? Who's the youngest? Who's the oldest? Who's the tallest? And who's the shortest? Red or blue, order it, smallest to biggest, watch out here comes the greater gator! Sam has two. I have two. And my friend, the Greater Gator, has two. It's our favorite even number. Two. Everybody's tied this time. One, two. One, two. One, two. Everybody has two numbers. Or, excuse me, two triangles. It's the same. They're all equal. My buddy, the Greater Gator, four toy bricks. Excuse me. One, two, three, four, five. He's gonna get five toy bricks. And what about me? It looks like I'm gonna get, well, we better count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It looks like I'm gonna get nine toy bricks. Ooh, so far, I've got the tallest. Nine. And for Pirate Sam, he's gonna get one, two, three, four, five. It looks like our buddy Pirate Sam will also have five. Okay, so the Greater Gator and the Pirate Sam both have the same amount. They each have five toy bricks. And in this example, I have the most. In this example, good old Pirate Sam, he's got two toy bricks. He has two toy bricks, excuse me. Looks like I have two toy bricks, and it looks like good old Greater Gator has one toy brick. Two, two, one, and they're all the same color in this example. But they don't all have to be the same color. You can have two be the same color, and you can have Someone else have a different color. In this example, me and Pirate Sam have two toy bricks, but the Greater Gator has nine blue bricks. And in this particular example, he again has the tallest stack. 
He has nine toy bricks. Alright, we've got seven. Oh, Greater Gator, he's eating the seven triangles. Okay, we've got four, we've got four, and we've got six. Hmm, I wonder which one is taller. I've got four, four, and six. I wonder which one is taller. I wonder if my friend the Greater Gator is going to come help us out. I wonder where he is. Oh, it's the Greater Gator, he's eating the six cubes. Oh, he's eating all the cubes. What's going on, Greater Gator? If you found this episode fun when we were organizing bar graphs, shortest to tallest, then you're in the right place. If your youngster loves numbers, you got to join that newsletter. That's how we'll grow this community and create math content that every youngin can enjoy and learn at their own pace. We'll catch you next time. God bless. A bonus, it looks like Pirate Sam has eight blocks, I have eight blocks, and the Greater Gator has eight blocks. Who has the most number of blocks right now? That's right, everybody is tied. Eight, eight, and eight. Each one of us have eight. And you can see that over here on this vertical axis. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. That's great, we all have eight blocks. Wow! Everybody has eight blocks. Who has the smallest number of blocks? That's right. Every single one of us. We all have eight. We each have the biggest number, and we each have the smallest number in this example. Pirate Sam, myself, and the Greater Gator. But who has the most tacos? Whoa, that's right. It looks like Pirate Sam has the most. This time, he has 10 tacos. I, on the other hand, only have five tacos, and the Greater Gator, as hungry as he gets, only has nine tacos. So the Greater Gator, in this particular example, does not have the most. In fact, I have... In fact, I have the least. I have five. Pirate Sam has ten tacos, I have five, and the Greater Gator has nine tacos. Wait, one more bonus? Who has the most blocks right now? And the Pirate Sam and me. We all have zero. So therefore, we all have the most. Ha 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 ha.